Hi, Steve here. We're at stage five. It's easier to see in the daytime what's expected of a shooter uh, during, a, during a, a certain scenario. This stage five has 10 paper targets and eight clays. If we walk around this way, you could see the scenario. It's, it's kind of confusing walking around it. You could see what it looks like here. And inside is meant to be a shoot house. After we walk around, we'll see the targets. And then we start. We can start with rifle at port arms, that's buttstock by your hip, muzzle above your nose. You start port arms, shooter ready, ready. The easiest way to do this is to engage the five targets with your heels on the line, two shots each, bang, 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 bang. Come through this way. A lot of people will try to shoot these targets from different angles, but if you, if you look at the course well and smart first and know where your targets are, right here you can get one, two, three, four, five targets. Then you take your rifle, you dump it, it's called a, a dump bucket, grab your scatter gun out of the other bucket, you got one low target, you shoot through the window, then you have seven more clays to shoot. What I did last night, the wind was coming from left to right and I shot my left target first. The wind was strong, the dirt over here is like talcum powder and it obscured my vision, so I shot a couple of these. I couldn't see my middle targets. I had to shoot my right targets and then come back for my left. So these uh, eight targets were done, and then shooter is done. Hi, Steve here, here with Heidi and Craig Salmon. They were ROs last night, and they also shot with us last night. And it's so refreshing to watch uh, semi-pros, I guess you would call them, running these courses. Heidi was like, Steve, go through here. Don't stick your head through this window. You can just stand right here on this bump, and you can see all four or five of these targets. What are you guys looking forward to tonight, and what's different tonight than yesterday? Well, I think tonight we're going to see a higher intensity level of shooters. We're going to see the top shooters in the nation out here and you're going to see some amazing speed and footwork and accuracy and just trigger speed. I mean, it's unbelievable what these guys can do out here. And it's obvious when someone like Craig and Heidi run this course how comfortable they are with uh, different scenarios and how they get their head in the game. And even late at night at four o'clock in the morning, they're still focused. And not only are they shooting, but they're watching knuckleheads like me to make sure I don't break a 180 or shoot my foot off or something like this. So it's, it's a lot of work. And uh, again, I have to thank Heidi and Craig so much for helping me a lot last night. I really learned a lot from you. It's, it's much appreciated. Appreciate it and best of luck RO in tonight and I hope you guys have a lot of fun. Thanks. Well thank you very much. We sure appreciate having you here and uh, everything we can do to uh, promote the three gun shooting sports. I'm here again with Kent from Crimson Trace. You had mentioned in the shooters meeting that there's actually a four thousand dollar incentive if the winner of the competition is running Crimson Trace products. Uh, yeah. Talk to us a little bit about what it means to have these shooters using your products, what you take back from an event like this. Well again, um, the, the main motivation for having the event was to introduce the benefits of lasers and lights uh, on weapons uh, to the whole community, whether it's the consumer, whether it's the press, or whether it's these top professional shooters. So, um, you know, we're gonna, whoever wins, we're gonna give them $6,000, that's the purse. And it's a, that's a really high purse for a three gun match. Sure. Uh, but if you're running Crimson Trace on all three of your guns, uh, we'll give you 10 grand. And obviously the incentive is gear up with Crimson Trace. We want you to have Crimson Trace product and so that you can see the benefits and how much uh, better shooter you're gonna be with our product on your weapons. Sure. I think you guys have been doing a really good job. Uh, earlier this year, Crimson Trace released a DVD called The Laser's Edge. Um, and actually, uh, some of you may be familiar with, we've actually shipped over 100,000 units so far. It's a fantastic DVD. Talk to us about how that came about, um, why it's been a useful tool for you guys, and sort of the next steps uh, building on this, uh, sort of expanding the, the use of lasers in the market. Oh, well, thanks for asking. We're, um, first and foremost, we're uh, really, really happy with the partnership with Optics Planet, and to be able to ship out 100,000 of these uh, training DVDs to, uh, to the general consumer base is a, is a really big deal. It came about because we consider ourselves the industry leader, and as the industry leader, we feel as though there's a, a great responsibility to help educate and train the consumer. And with the influx, of new gun owners into the marketplace. We feel really, really strongly that it's our job to help educate them how to train with lasers and without lasers so that they can become comfortable with their handguns. And the whole purpose of the DVD is to walk people through 
all the different training methods that will make you a more accurate and a more confident shooter. And we sort of made it, a, turn it into a little bit of a cinematic piece. And we, um, we took a real life scenario that came from one of our consumers and we reenacted it. It was an incident where uh, someone was a victim of road rage. And fortunately, uh, just as depicted in the DVD in real life, um, the threat was actually averted by the use of a laser. No one got hurt that day and they didn't get hurt because uh, the person who was attacked had a laser on their weapon. Sure. And that DVD is still available with select purchases at Optics Planet, free of charge. Um, again, thank you for providing those to us. Absolutely. I know you got to get ready for the match. As you can see, the sun's starting to go down. So again, we're at uh, night three of the Midnight Three Gun Invitational. Enjoy. Enjoy.